Burke is going to chase here on Murillo. Got bodied off by Ibiaga. Under hits the pads. Burke gets there in front of Crapo. What does Ismail Alfab do? Judging by the players' reactions, this is not good for Crapo right now. I mean, he's brave. He's brave. He has to come out. Potentially saves the game here. And yeah, just this is this is not good. We are uh, four months out of post surgery. Uh, it's been quite a ride, but every week I feel better. I feel a progression. So this is a, a lot of positive to take on from week to week. Day to day, it's sometimes it's more difficult because some days you'll feel great, others you'll feel not so great. And that's the, the reality that you need to cope on one long-term injuries and the surgery that I had. This used to be so easy, now it's so hard. <laughs> but it's, you know, every Monday I feel better than, uh, than the one before. So I, it's, a, it's a positive thing. And where am I right now? The fracture is completely healed. The fractures are good. It's just a matter of finding the, the muscle strength and elasticity back. And um, basically my body is not uh, used anymore to have that, that physical load. And so everything needs to be able to, to go again, especially that leg up. Every phase is a little bit different. Obviously, when he first got hurt, it was just trying to get that range. It was trying to get that muscle to even contract again. Now that we're doing more dynamic activity, we have to, it's not just strength, it's like that pliability, that stretch that we need in order to absorb the impact when he's doing ladder drills or plyometrics. And so now it's really, building everything back and have a blank canvas and work on yourself of how do you want to, to come back. It's a lot of hours and no secret, it's a lot of hours of work, of preparation, and uh, eventually we'll, we'll be back out there and playing.